the number of times a given factor appears in factored form of a polynomial is called the multiplicity. So the multiplicity is the exponent. It tells you how many times that zero appears. Now the sum of the multiplicities, when you add up all your multiplicities, that will give you the degree of the polynomial function. You should also know that if your multiplicity is odd, then the graph of the function will cross the x-axis at that zero. And if your multiplicity is even, it's going to touch the x-axis at that zero. So here we have a graph. First of all, we want to determine what is the degree of this polynomial function. Well, all we have to do is add up all our multiplicities and it will give us the degree of the polynomial. Uh, so the multiplicities are the exponents. So this is a two plus three plus one. You should know when you don't see anything there, it's understood to be a one. So that's a total of six. So this is a six degree polynomial. Now we want to look at uh, the odd exponents. So we have an odd exponent here. And at that zero, if you solve for x, that zero would be at three. Uh, we also have another uh, odd at negative one. Um, if we solve for x. So you're going to have where your graph is going to cross and pass through the x-axis at 3 and at negative 1, as you see in the graph. Now the even, the even is where it will touch the x-axis. And if you were to take the outside, set it equal to 0 and solve for x, x equals 0. So at 0 is where it will touch the x-axis. Notice that this being a six degree polynomial, uh, that the end behavior is both ends up because you don't see any negatives outside here for the coefficient.